International Drug Policy Consortium and it gives me great pleasure to be the chair for this morning's plenary session on drug policy, the push for justice, with my beautiful, um, inspiring and diverse panel of speakers who I'm, I'm honoured to be introducing to you today. Um, the fight for justice within drug policy is very critical, um, as we heard yesterday from the High Commissioner for Human Rights. Um, there is still much work to do. There is an unmitigated human rights disaster that still goes on in the name of the war on drugs in so many parts of the world. And today we will hear from our speakers about the important work that they are doing on this front to continue the fight for social justice and human rights in drug policy. So without further ado, I'm going to introduce our first speaker. I'm very honoured to introduce Dr. Mary Chillery Hesse. Um, she's a dear friend and a mentor of mine. Um, Dr. Chinnery Hesse is a retired international civil servant who served as the UN resident coordinator and UNDP resident representative in several countries. She was the first African woman to be appointed to that position and she was appointed as the first woman Deputy Director of the International Labour Organization with the rank of Under Secretary General of the UN. She's also served as Chief Advisor to the President of the Republic of Ghana. She is currently Chancellor at the University of Ghana and serves as a friend to the African Panel, Union Panel of the Wise and is a Commissioner of the West African Commission on Drugs and also is a dear and beloved board member of the IDPC. Mary, you have the floor. Good morning. What a pleasure to see so many people coming to listen to me speak. <laughs> and uh, such a special group. Um, I'm so happy to have the opportunity to present the voice of Africa, which uh, generally tends to be rather muted. And um, to be speaking to people really who have the third 